A Chihuahua is one of the cutest breeds of dogs you can have in your family. They have stolen the hearts of many dog fanciers. We discuss theories of their origins and many virtues of adopting a Chihuahua, but having one is a big responsibility. Let's discover some of the drawbacks and pitfalls of having a Chihuahua companion. Chihuahuas are one of the healthiest and long-lived dogs on the planet. A well-cared-for Chihuahua can live and love up to around 20 years with very few sick days. However, the Chihuahua, due to its extremely small size of between 2 to 6 pounds, is comparatively weak and easily injured compared to other dogs. They are so small, they can hurt themselves even falling off the couch, so special care must be required. Their tiny legs can easily be broken, and tiny frail backs can easily be damaged. Even wearing a collar can damage their tracheas. This is not a dog that can tolerate rough play, and should not be left unattended with small children or larger pets. Cheese originated in Mexico. They were bred from the 9th century or earlier to live in that warm climate. They also have small bodies that don't retain heat as well as more massive dogs. Therefore, it's hard for a chihuahua to survive in cold weather. If you live where the winters are cold, you must put some clothes on your chihuahua to keep it warm or you might want to invest in a potty pad so that your chi doesn't have to go out to use the potty. Either way, your chihuahua should not be exposed to cold for any amount of time. And be careful when sitting down. You don't want to accidentally sit on your chi who has crawled under a blanket or carelessly dropped sweater. Chihuahuas are not generally people dogs. A well socialized pup can be friendly with strangers, but it's not their default nature. They will bond with one person. Even in a family, your chi will decide that it likes one person more than the others. It's only natural. Don't get your feelings hurt if it's not you. And if they feel uncomfortable or threatened, they can nip or bite, and it does actually hurt. Do socialize your chihuahua at an early age. It makes them a much more pleasant pet. It'll definitely make it easier for you to have guests over. I've included the chihuahua in my top small guard dogs list for a good reason. They bark quite readily but they are not the best choice of pet if you live in a place where silence is preferred or you live quite literally on top of your neighbors. They do alert bark, but they also bark if they are left alone or otherwise anxious. There's not much you can do about this other than not leaving them alone. If you work or go to school all day, the chi is probably not the best pet for you. They also don't deal well with change, so if you move a lot, the chi should be off your list of top pets. Before I get to the last reason, I'd like to take a moment to invite you to my new blog. It's called Really Cute Dog Costumes, and you'll find it at reallycutedogcostumes.com. One word, no spaces. It's a blog where I find cute dog costumes. Pretty self-explanatory, but it's fun. Generally speaking, the Chihuahua is a pleasure to train, especially when it comes to tricks. It responds well to positive reinforcement and reward-based training. The exception to this rule is when it comes to potty training. Their small size means they have tiny bladders. A chihuahua can't hold it long. And because they can't hold it long, you might not even have time to notice that your poor chi has to go. They are also quite stubborn when it comes to things they have made a habit of. It's hard to change a chi once they start pottying in the house. There are options, and they can be trained, but 100% success with potty training a chi is rare. So if you're into antique or otherwise expensive rugs or enjoy walking around your house in socks, the Chihuahua might not be the best pet for you. Can you think of any other reasons someone should avoid getting a Chihuahua? Leave them in the comments below. Here are a few more videos for you to enjoy. Might as well smash that subscribe button while you're at it. And as always, catch you next time.